Welcome to St. Charles, Missouri. First semifinal of the day, D2, Denver Barbarians on the left and the green and white stripes. Boston Irish Wolfhounds attacking on now from right to left. We're seven minutes into it. Scores 3-0. Denver Barbarians got their initial score. Some brilliant tactical ticking. Drew the penalty on the five meter line. They let you to go for post. Since the reset, we've had very strong pressure by the Irish Wolfhounds. Strong scrummaging, hard tackling in the middle. Now their opportunity. See the decision they go with. And they're going to the post. Got the Denver Barbarian coach counting down for the referee's benefit. Apparently he's got a better stopwatch than the ref does. <laughs> As you can hear, he can count well. <laughs> and off to the right. 22 dropout to Bar Denver. comes the drop out deep down the middle of the field and the counter attack coming up quickly over some hard hits at the rocks already today noticed several times It's a balmy 85 degrees right now in St. Charles, going up to 94 today. At least. There's a little surprise. Yeah. All right. Yeah, he's on the field. Scrum to Denver. Good platform by Denver on this one. That's a eight pick. Four yeah. pass. After the initial flurry from Denver, the game's kind of settled down a little bit. A little more predictable play. Let's go, Lots of enthusiastic folks on both sidelines. Everyone has to be behind the rope line. Does that include their coaches? We're handling it. Thank you. Yep. Thank you. yep. Coaches, coaches too? Yeah. Uh, Mark Nelson was going to confirm with the match commissioner okay. before, but he's going to say something. Okay. Yep. That's why I didn't say anything to you yet. Mark's nice platform here as well. There we go. And wide. Tack on the outside channel. Good meters out there. Ball's bouncing around and into touch. So promising attack there by the Wolfhounds. Ends with a turnover. Oriam, we saw several lineouts by Denver, executing them extremely well. Very sharp and crisp on their lineouts. Boston looks to contend, contest. Ah, an overthrow there. Turnover. 
First errant line out, leading to an opportunity here. Probing around the edges. Good hard up, well met by the defense. And held up in goal. This will be a goal line dropout. So somebody come in a chest gas me get behind. Uh, yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Let's go, Owen. It's you. It's all you, Owen. Well done, lads. There we go, boys. Well done, Pat. Well done, Pat. Good job, Pat. We have this, lads. We have this. Let's go. Go home. Let's go, Owen. 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 Let's to honor that, ball goes in to touch. Landed first, line out to Boston. We got this up. Go. <laughs> Little jockeying around in the line out. Really well contested, but still cleanly played. And a strong run up. It's number eight, Lee McSherry. Continue on out. In the corner. Running out of real estate out there. Got quick hands by Denver. But that's going to get them a penalty advantage back to Boston. Ball on the ground there, kicking the turnover, but the advantage not gained. Went for points last time. This time looks like they're going to elect the line out. Kicking for touch. Number 11 for Boston. That's Jake Kaplan. Here you go, boys! Here you go, Hoots! Watch the ball! All right, let's see what we got here. Looks like they elected to go with the full line out. Denver gets off the ground really quick and steals. Turns and runs. Unforced error there. I'm going to go to the source and talk to the coach. Yeah. And another punishing run. Reversing the field. Going down the backside channel. That's Owen O'Reilly, Irish U18. And penalty at the breakdown, awarded to Denver. They escape again. It's twice now that Boston Irish have been down in very close proximity to scoring and have turned the ball over. It's the clearing kick. Nice strike by Lane Wynn there. Go take it, boys. Go take it. Let's go out. Go, boys. Here go, out. The last 15 minutes, been all Boston Irish, but some frantic defense. Yes, yes, and good coverage. Here you go, boys. And a steal on the line out. And an advantage on the knock on. Going to Boston. Referee's indicating this might be the last whistle before a 20 minute water break. Built that into the schedule, just out of 
player safety concerns. It is very hot, and we've got some good humidity here. Need to make sure we keep these players hydrated. Eight-man pick. Well defended by Denver. And a turnover. Oh, penalty. Going in from the side, not rolling away. Referee will not end the water break here. Gonna have a chat with the captain from the Barbos. That's Alex Warmer. Flanker number seven. And another set piece opportunity for Boston. Denver has gamely challenged these. A quick one up. And again, difficulty securing their own line out. Ball turned over. Remember looking to clear here. Ball stays in play. Reversing field coming across. Cut back inside, coming back to some help. Still running on his own. And very quickly, over the top. Penalty at the breakdown. Eric Sykes, who came in very quickly. Perhaps just a bit too quickly for our referee, Lex. So clarification on the Denver side, penalty was for not supporting his own weight, hands on the ground, not coming in too soon. Hooked it again. And so in with another 22 dropout. We'll go to our 20 minute water break here. We are 21 minutes into the match. Yep, thank you. And we're back from water break. This will start with a 22 dropout by Denver. Second missed attempt at points for Boston. <clears throat> We've had some strong opportunities here. They've just gone wanting. 
So we double check to work. Yeah. Okay. okay. You don't see that very often. You know the referee is standing there. You might need to go around him. You're gonna try that trick play. <laughs> Going deep this time. Long driving kick. Oh, slipping down the side there. Post was not there. And next thing you know, they're on their front foot and attack. Little chip ahead, playing the man out of bounds. It's like they're going to let that one go. There'll be some talk about that, I'm sure, online. You have to at least make an attempt to wrap when you're putting somebody down like that. All right, here we go. Set piece opportunity for Boston. One nicely, big forward pod coming in, and again, big collision. in all over the place here, but referee's letting him play. And again, nobody on the post there. Some happy feet there, but nowhere to go. Takes his time, dishes. Now looking to go wide. Knock on there. After multiple phases, again, the Denver pressure on defense causes a turnover. Except medical and water. It's, that's what it was yesterday. It's better. So that'll be the standard all day today. Okay. Thanks, Thank Mark. Medics, media, water care. Scrum down to Barbos. The most important, the ball. Uh, yeah, yes. Obviously, the ball. The ball. Nice platform. Working in the backside wing here. Got numbers outside, 15 steps through. Lots of pressure now, headed up, headed up. Nice open field tackle, but there's good support. Both wings involved here with the fullback. And just like that, they flip the field. Advantage to Barbos here. Yeah. Good hard tackle in the middle there. Advantage still on for Denver. Another penalty here. We had penalty advantage on. Yeah. 
You got a number? 14. 14 coming out. Yellow card. That's Ronan Griffin. Let's spend some time in the happy box. Here you go, mate. All right, let's sit. You can sit in the chair. Oh, yeah, good point. Sit in the chair. Actually, that's kind of fun. Two minutes, two minutes, you can stand and warm up. Okay. Right, here's been a really good part of Denver's offense here, these line outs. Up to the front. Well taken. A little trick play inside. And stays in. And bounds. Held up in goal. Stout defense there. Nicely executed trick play there by Denver on that line out. Does not yield points on this. Steal it, Barbos! Attempt. Line out to Boston. Yeah, but that's, that's not what he said his name is. He said his name was Jake. Then you scoot it over to here. Yeah, he's running the wrong number. I just, just like, I just like, there is no Jake. Like, oh, shit. Sorry, Jake here. Yeah. 11. 11. 14, they do it all the time. Yeah. Oh, you want to handle the turn? Change this to 14 and that's 11. Okay. 11. Or... Wait, I get to stand? I said two minutes. I said. With two minutes to go, you can oh, with two minutes to go. So, oh, correction, uh, uh, numbers to over here to the yeah, stat table. Yeah, two minutes to Reverse go. the wings. Yeah. So, that is Jake Kaplan in the send bin. Win it, Barbo! Number 14. If you're going to cramp or something, that's why I'm trying to. <laughs> it's pretty yep. warm in the thing. Yep. You get a cramp, obviously. That's right. Lex is going to have the boys reset. Not happy with the platform at front. Getting late into the second half here. Pick up, well defended. Opportunity, perhaps for a better angle on that clear kick. But they'll take the penalty. This can definitely flip the field. So Boston Irish Wolfhounds with some stout defense. We've seen that from Denver all day. Uh, Boston with a little bit of breathing room here. Gonna go quick up front. Nope. Up to the front. Well defended by Denver. Boston gathers it up. Good hard hit. That was Dante Brown coming in with a hard hit. Feeling the effects of it as well, but when you see a big, big player run into a little guy, and the little guy takes that hit. You gotta be impressed. Ball back to Denver. Counter attack. Ball out to yes, Noah Flom. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, I was like, no, I got, I met her this morning. Yeah, she's just a neutral. And they only have one as well. I didn't know it was. 
Nice box kick down to the corner. Finds a soft spot. Pressure's on. And escapes the first. Counterattack going forward. Nice chip ahead. Well defended over the top. Temper on the front foot. Unfortunate. Just a little bit of patience there. Might have done well for Denver. Uh, yes, I'll find out. Uh, five to go. Five to go. Man down. We're going to take a minute here. Cramping up. It is hot. Are you doing your app this weekend? Yeah. I still have it on the phone. Actually, it's a little bit more from when we finally got over here. Okay. It's, it's five minutes right now. Okay. All right. We're back at it. Water off. Scrum to Boston. Really nice counterattack by Denver. Just couldn't quite gather that ball up in the last breakdown there. Can you have a second? They won't let me stand. That's what I've been doing. Oh, and again, nice looking scrum. Tacking up the middle, found a little gap. Going with it. And that's something you don't see often. A lock with a kick ahead, looking for the 50-22. That clearing kick did not find its way out of Denver territory. And a yellow card. Multiple warnings throughout this half. What's good for the goose is good for the gander. Both teams now with the yellow card. What number? Five. That's number five. I didn't understand that. Joe Goldblum. I'm looking at the ref. I'm like, I'm trying to get out. I've got both. Yeah. Very nice kick. Good opportunity late in the half for Boston. Overthrow there. Another opportunity lost by Boston. Carrying it up. Setting the platform. Getting ready. Jake, two minutes. Disdaining the kick. We're going to go ahead and. I'm going to go ahead and run it out. They do. Oh, ball on the ground there. Joe. How much time? Two minutes. Yep. Good to see you again. Me too. You're in, uh, yeah, he's just. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, I just gave him a two minute warm to warm up. <laughs> Getting into the waning minutes of the half here. Boston with another opportunity. Both teams down a man. Nice push by the Hounds. Nice push. Yeah, boys. 
like I'm a bad guy in your eyes, but not everyone else's. That's well covered. Out on the outside. Exploring, poking, and in for the try. And some extracurricular activities. We'll get a number on that try for it. Austin score. Eric, Austin score. Number on the score. Uh, three, minutes, three, and three to half. Sammy, three to half. What number score? Score five to three. Boston Irish looking to convert here. And nicely struck and through. That's your fly half, Lewis. 15. Morale. Thank you. And the score of the try, 15. That's Owen O'Reilly. See the guy that missed those two penalty kicks earlier? And it makes that crazy. So after two missed attempts in front of the post, get a beautiful strike from the corner. Tells me, make it harder next time. Score now, eight to seven to three, Boston. Deep restart. A clear kick does not find touch. And here's the counter attack right off the bat. We've seen Denver very dangerous in these situations. They've got pace on the outside. Move the ball well. I get some good tech. Getting close to the end of the half here. Put in by Boston Irish. They've had their way with their scrums today. Good shove there as well. And on it comes. Backside wing coming in. With the wraparound. Forward pass. Let him go, boy! Hey, Dante! Could be the last play of the half. Put in by Denver. Nice push by Denver. Ball out. Looking to go wide, but stepping through it. Ten. Turnover ball. Advantage to Boston here. And that's our half. Finish up seven to three. Really exciting game. Lots of turnover here, back and forth. We're gonna take a 10 minute break here. We'll be back on air in five.
Walker live. And we're back. Sorry for the technical difficulties there. Back here. About 18 minutes left in the match. Score still 10-7. Denver over Boston Irish Wolfhounds. There's gaps. Sykes, let's go. Coming wide. Shooter! Yeah. Oh, steps inside behind the shooter there. And then nice big gap coming through. Good offload and support. Back downfield. Here we go. Numbers on the outside if they choose it. Instead, nice little dart around the back of the ruck there. And to the outside. Tackle in the touch. With about 15 minutes left, the subs are flowing freely now on both sides. Tactical subs, and this is a, such an important part of the game. Can they keep up? The pace. Mr. Ref, Mr. Ref, Mr. Ref, sorry, five not off. Mr. Ref, five, five not off, not five. Let's go, Shawnee! Let's go! You want me? I'm Shawnee or not? Yes, yes, right. Yes, go. John? Yes. Okay, John. Back. I got to go. Let's go, Matt. We'll get all those subs for you in just a minute. Lots of discussion about the who's coming in and who's not. Critical point in the match here. Well, Boston Irish. Right? Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> One minute in. Chaos. And again, overthrown. Denver first on the ball there. But the opportunity here. Counter ruck is hard, but ends with a penalty. Here we go, hard run up, off the double pods, running towards the post. Nice hit. Denver finding space, pushing through, and rewarded with a try. One of the new subs that just came on, that was Corey Jacobs, number 16. I didn't hear it. Didn't hear it. Mm -hmm. We're gonna do a little call out here to one of our viewers out over in Scandinavia. That's Carl, former coach of Denver Barbarians. Thank you, Carl, for watching. Welcome back. Yes, sir. Takes the score 15 to 7. Pending the conversion here. Could extend it to a 10 point match. Let's go, baby. Finish time. Try to update the rosters for you here in just a minute. Conversion missed. Score stays 15 to 7. Let's get them going, okay? Let's go! And here we go with some of our substitutions here on the Barbo side. We got 21. That's Beanie Miller that came in. We already talked about Corey Jacobs coming in. We've got number 20, Donovan Ronan in on the pitch. And number 18. That's Max Murphy. No. Okay. No, it wouldn't be 15. Yeah, it's 10, 10 and 5. 
15. It was 10 to 7. 10 to 7. And they scored a try. They scored that was a the try, most so obvious 12. thing. No, uh, Barbo scored the try. Thank you for that. <laughs> the green team. Oh, which one? <laughs> All right, penalty to Denver. Opportunity to clear here. Finds touch. Just across the midfield. There's update on roster changes for Boston. We have number 17 in. That's Sean Moran. Number 23, Bobby Martin is called out earlier. Number 22, that's Nolan Joyce. Or William Connors, excuse me. Number 20 on the field, Sean Roberts. Number 16 on the field. That's Ye Ye Israel. Ye Yan Israel. Ye Yan. Number 24 on the field, Nolan Joyce. Number 19 on the field, Jack Finch. And number 21, Robert Haller. Just over 10 minutes here. Denver in control. Ball coming wide now. Here it comes. Long passing. Cut back in the inside. Looking for the outside off low, but couldn't get it. Got a man down here from Boston. Took a hard shot in the face on that ruck. Boys. Megan. He needs him. Landers. Yeah. That's what that's what they're looking to do. The number on the last try. Uh, Sixteen. Thank you. He had just came in. I yep, just that. came in. Denver off the 50-22 line out, looking dangerous. Pa was not as well formed as some of their earlier, but they've got the ball out clear. Shooter on the outside. Twelve Lex keep it. Punches up, ball loose. Good, hard work around the point of contact. There's some desperation right now for the Wolfhounds, the way they're working. They know it, running out of time. Denver methodically working it in, but as soon as we say that, then they're back 20 meters and lose the ball. Knock on, oh, now played it forward. Should be a penalty there for playing it in an offside position, but I was going to say he already blew the whistle up before that was played. Got a load of barbarians coming on. 23, 22, and 19 coming on. That's Jack O'Connor. Landon Banks. And Karen Langston. Langskov. Karen Langskov. Coming off. Pullback. The 13. Opportunity here. Boston needs to work with a sense of urgency. Running out of time. Good push up. Didn't like the movement there. It's going to reset them. You can hear the Boston Irish Wolfhound sideline urging on their team to get moving. Time is a wasting.
stalemate at the scrum. Ball coming out. Skip two. Ball on the ground. Opportunity for Denver. Just under eight. Just under eight. Penalty against Boston. Now, keeping some time. Taking it, taking some time. Call out for the team. About eight minutes left in the match. Says the Denver sideline. We'll take their word for it. Is counting this time for the penalty kick from the Denver sideline. Yeah, missed that kick. It was deliberate with a strike. It looks good from here, but just outside. <laughs> Good catch. Tie your shoe, Bo. Ball and clearing kick. Coming all the way back. That's Beanie Miller. Challenge the ruck at all there. Nice clear. Staying in bounds, keeping ball alive. No, no challenge at the ruck. Giving Denver plenty of time to set up their platform. Ball went backwards. So that could be obstruction. And there it is. Puts it on out. There's the step around the outside. There's some pace and the try in the corner. That was 14. Jake Kaplan. It's one of those guys that spent a little time in the happy place over here next to us for 10 minutes. And that 10 minute rest is what he needed. And we are getting into desperate times here. 15 to 12. It's 23. Javi Martin. Looking to pull it to within one. Doesn't have the leg on it. Score stays at 15 12. touch. Nice aerial skills. Well played. Yep. Number 19 for the Barbarians, Kirian. 
15-12. Jane Langskov. Ah, there we go. Cleanly played. Pushing it out. Some inverted passing there, but well recovered. Again, going down the sidelines, some high passing. It takes a little bit of pace off for these guys when they're coming onto it. They have to adjust to that ball. And another charge down by Denver. But now the big hit there. Advantage two, there's the turnover. It's Eric Sykes. He's been quick to that ball all day. Man down for Boston, time off. They've used up all their subs, so I'm like they can bring somebody else on. to take the points here. That makes it a try differential if they can put it through. With almost no time left. Here you go, boys. Get bored, three minutes officially left on the clock here. getting urged on by their bench here. There's almost no time left. We're hearing everything between a minute and a half to three minutes. And Lex on the field is the one that keeps the official time. We'll figure it out when he blows that final whistle. Long clearing kick. Went straight into touch. That is one you want back. Straight into touch. Gives him a scrum down. Or line out back. Denver takes the scrum at the 22. Split backs by Denver. Attacking opportunity on either side. And it comes, big push by Boston. Ball caught up underneath, and whistle blown before the stolen scrum. That was a big shove. Expected again. Desperate times for Boston. A uh, big push, ball off the back. Going wide. Looked like an opportunity to link up on the outside, but into the tackle. Fair enough, don't lose the ball. Good counter ruck there, but still going strong down the sideline. The outside channel. Stolen ball at the breakdown. 
advantage to Boston, though. Uh, put on the ground there. And that's it. Final score, 15 to 12. What a fantastic match. Great work by both sides. Such great effort. Disappointment for Boston after all that hard work. Relation for Denver going on to the finals again for Division Two. They'll be playing that tomorrow. We'll get the score from the other field in just a moment here. Hi, buddy. We want to thank you for joining us for this one. We'll be back at 1 o'clock for our next match. We'll go on uh, radio silence here for a while. We'll see you then. Thanks for being with us.